Hi guys, welcome to this video. Now you may well know that uh, Chrome OS is in the making and it's going to be quite a hefty size to download but it's going to be super fast. Well there's an actual smaller version that you can download already if you want to have a look at it. You can actually get it from this link here okay? and there's a BitTorrent link there and also a couple of mirror links. It gives you the Windows instructions, Mac instructions and the Linux instructions there. Also fre frequently asked questions if you've got any questions about uh, the application itself. Now remember it's in early stages so it is a bit buggy uh, but if you want to report a bug to him then you can do by emailing him. It's this guy here, Hicks, he's made the, app, made the actual application here. So It was called uh, Chrome OS Diet yesterday but today it's called Chrome OS Cherry. Okay so let's uh, have a little look at the other version you can get you can get it from this op uh, this website here. This is the actual website. You can actually get the VMDK image file that you can run on VirtualBox, VMware Fusion, which is for Macs, and VM Player, uh, VMware Player, which is uh, another version of like VirtualBox. So you can actually download it from this link. You will have to register to get the image. Okay. Now I've already got my image in my C root directory as you can well see there, it's sitting there. So I'm just going to show you how to set it up uh, in a virtual box so you can actually see what it looks like. So all you need to do here first is go to File, Virtual uh, Media Manager, then Add, then go to the location where you've got your file, which in this case is my C root directory. OK, click on there and then click OK. And then what we need to do now is go New to add a new operating system. So I'm just going to call this a uh, test, something of this nature, and then come down to Linux, and then leave that on Ubuntu. Okay, go next, and this is where you can play with your memory. I'm just going to whack a bit in there like so. Go next. Now you don't want to do create a new hard disk here. You want to actually use uh, use existing hard disk and point it to uh, that VMDK file. Okay, Chrome OS. Click, go next, and then finish. Okay, that's pretty much it really. You're actually okay to load this up now. So once this is loaded up, you should start to see the actual uh, Chrome OS Cherry or Diet version or whatever you want to call it load up. And there you go. So all you need to do here now is, uh, I think he did say there's, a, a, there's an actual default you can use. I'm not sure if this is going to work because it never worked for me the other day it's saying incorrect so what you need to do at this stage is either um, put one in that you do do have okay I'm just going to whack that in like so and we should be there we should be signed in and that will be it okay so there you have the actual login in so I hope this video has been some use here. My name is Brian from brightech.co.uk. If you enjoy all my videos, please subscribe to my channel. And uh, if you haven't registered for my forum yet, uh, get yourself over there and register. It's free to register. Post your questions in there. It's going to be a lot easier for me to answer them for you. Okay. And thank you guys for your support. Nearly a thousand subscribers now, so I'm well chuffed with that. So keep your subscriptions coming. Keep pushing that subscribe button. And thanks again to everyone. Bye for now.